in my video number 18 pattern filled text I was asked if you could also use an image to do that and yes you can um, so I wanted to show you right quick I'm not going to go through getting the image in turning it into a path and getting you know um, your pattern and turning that into a path and all of that I'm just going to show you right quick it's the pretty much um, the same steps so here is a path of a rabbit and here is a path of a chevron so uh, first thing I'll do is duplicate that and I'll put that aside and I will put this on top of my chevron pattern and I'll select them both and I'll do path intersection and that's going to give me the um, pattern and then I'm going to duplicate this again and I'm going to do a path outset and I'm going to do that quite a few times uh, and then I'm going to lower that to the bottom and I'm going to select both of them and I'm going to do a path difference and that's going to give me an outline okay and they're both paths the outline and the chevron um, you can select them both turn them the same color whichever color you want uh, you can group them if you want to cut them separately the outline separate from the pattern or you can line them up a little better than what I did here and sometimes if you have space in there and you don't like that just select your chevron and do an outset on that it will make it a little bit thicker too see so now it's all touching around um, and then select them both and you can like I said either group them or you can do a path union if you do a path union it's gonna cut just like this and you'll weed out all the white parts and all the purple parts are connected um, so if you group them and cut them separately then you're gonna have to use transfer tape and line them up um, I prefer to do it this way but that's totally up to you how you want to do it so uh, then you can go to file save as uh, choose the destination give it a name and save it as a plain SVG and that's it it's pretty simple so uh, try it out and thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video